Hi, I'm going to show you how to create a macro in Microsoft Word 2007. First, make sure you have a document open with text. You can use an old essay. I just typed this paragraph really quickly so that after we create an, our macro, you can see what it looks like when we apply it. Then open a new document. You can click this button here because you always want to record your macro in a new document. So we're going to start, click View, and then in the Macros group, click Macros, and record macro. Since this macro is going to be used when you've written a paper and you just want to make those last minute changes before you turn it in, we're going to call it Paper Finished. You can never use spaces when you create the name of a macro, it just doesn't work. Click Keyboard, and then we want our macro to be um, activated by a shortcut. You have to make sure you use a shortcut that isn't already in use, so you can't do Control U or Control I because those are shortcuts that actually are macros themselves, so you can't use those. Let's do Alt I. You can make sure it's unassigned because it'll tell you that it's unassigned. Then click Assign and then Close. First thing we want our macro to do is double space the text. So go to Home in the paragraph group, change this to 2.0. We also want it to change our font to Arial. Um, to change the page margins to half an inch all around. and then to spell check the document. When you're done recording your macro, you can either click this stop button here. If it doesn't appear, just go back to the view tab, the macros group, and stop recording. Go back to your document that you had open with text. Select all the text by control A, clicking and dragging, etc. and then Apply your macro by typing in the command that you chose. We chose Alt-I, so hold Alt, click I, and there's your macro.